Uh, Shalom, all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bashim Yahshua, Bashim Kakadash, double honors to the other apostles of Great Millstone, and salutation you all can teach all truth and sincerity. Um, <clears throat> it's going to be called um, The Lord Speaks Through His Prophets. Um, so I'm going to start this off in um, Jeremiah. Chapter 7 and verse 25, it says, Since the day that your fathers came forth out of the land of Egypt unto this day, have I sent unto you all my servants the prophets, uh, daily rising up early and sending them. So, um, Yahweh Shem uh speaks to his prophets, through the men of the Lord, out in the highways and byways, week in and week out, um, you know, prophesying to the children of Israel, which are the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Uh, we're we're uh, the men, of, uh, us men of the Lord, are out here speaking to our people, you know, whether they want to hearken or not. You know, um, we're we're um, warning you. Before the destruction to come, you know, um, that's what uh, Yahweh Bashin Yahshai does. He 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 brings forth the prophets before the um, the destruction comes. So when the destruction comes, you have no you have no um, no excuse. You know, you can't say that 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 the men of the Lord, the prophets, didn't warn you before it came. You know, and basically. The Most High spreads, sets up Salaki. The Most High sets up the prophets. So uh, the prophets, those men that are prophesying, can get that blood off their hands. And when destruction comes, they're not um, caught up in that destruction. You know, the blood is off their hands. So, you know, uh, like it says in Ezekiel, if you don't warn the people, the, that blood, the Most High will require that blood on you if you don't if you don't warn the people. You know, you know if that prophet doesn't warn the people, that blood is required of that prophet. You know, but anyway, um, since I mentioned one scripture, uh, I'm gonna get uh, Jeremiah 28 and 8. Um, it's, this is Jeremiah 28. 8. It says, "The prophets that have been before me and before thee of old." Prophesied against many countries and against great kingdoms of war and of evil and of pestilence. So the prophets were set up before uh, all that for the war came, for the evil, for the bad times came, before the pestilence, for the plagues and pestilence came. The prophets were set up to prophesy for all, for to prophesy all that to come, all that to shortly come to pass. You know. Um, <clears throat> and the prophets, to be a prophet, you have to be of the nation of Israel. You can't just be of another nation. You got to be of from Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. You just can't be um, a heathen prophesying. If, if uh, a person looks like a heathen prophesying, he's uh, got to be from Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, you know. Um, this is um, Psalms 147 and 19. He says, He showeth his word unto Jacob and his statutes and his judgments unto Israel. It says, He have not dealt so with any nation. So the most, uh, Yahweh Bashim Yahshai showed his statutes and his judgments unto, only, only to Israel. He, he has dealt no, he has not dealt with any other nation. No other nation, like it says in Amos uh, 3, Amos 3, Salaki, Amos 3, 1 through 2, it says, ye, ye only have I known of all the families of the earth, therefore I shall punish you for all your iniquities. Um, rough, roughly paraphrasing that, you know, um, that's what Amos 3, uh, 1 through 2, roughly paraphrasing, saying. The most I only dealt only dealt dealt with Israel. He only gave Israel the law, statutes, commandments, 
he didn't give no other nation the law, statute, commandments. He only dealt with Israel. Um, I'm gonna read um, Psalms 147:20 over again. It says he has not dealt so with any nation, and as for his judgments, they have not known them. Praise ye, Yahweh, Bashim Yahshai. So basically, Yahweh Bashim Yahshai never dealt with any other nation besides Israel, and that's why the prophets of old were Israelites because he gave them the laws he gave the whole nation the laws statutes and but basically he he showed his secrets his 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 wisdom knowledge understanding to the prophets you know um, I'm gonna go to uh, hold on let me go to uh, 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 this is um Luke 1 and 70 it says as he spake by the mouth of his holy prophets which have been since the world began that he should be saved from all our enemies and from the hand of all that hate us so <clears throat> he uh, the most high only spoke through the men of the Lord the prophets um, of old um, he showed them the secrets uh, he um it says that we should be saved from our enemies and from the hand of all that hate us. And the prophets come before and to prophesy and warn the people so they can turn back to Yahweh and Yahshai and repent. And so that we can be delivered from those, uh, those the heathens that hate us, the people that, um, the enemies, our enemies, which are the, the heathen nations, you know, that hate us. Cause they do hate us. Um, I'm gonna go to uh, scripture and um, cause we we we're not just the prophets of um, of Israel. We're also the prophets to the nations. We were uh, raised up to be to warn our people and to tell these heathens their judgment. You know, um, uh, this is uh, Jeremiah one and verse four. It says, uh, this is Jeremiah 1 and verse 4. It says, the word of Yahweh came unto me, saying, Before I, I formed thee in the belly, I knew thee. And before thou camest forth out of the womb, I sanctified thee, and I, I ordained thee a prophet unto the nation. And this is Yahweh talking to um, the prophet Jeremiah, um, saying that before, basically, Jeremiah was born, before he was formed in the womb, before... You know, his parents came together to bring him to life, to bring him out, to prophesy, you know, in the near future. Um, the Most High ordained and knew Jeremiah's spirit, just like he knows all the prophets' spirits before they get into the womb, before they come out and, and are born. You know, he knows um, you before you uh, even are born. Um, and he ordained um, Jeremiah, the prophet, before he, to be a prophet unto the nations, to be a prophet unto Israel and to the other nations, to prophesy and warn the, the nation of Israel to to prophesy and, and tell the heathen their their future judgment. You know, their um, and uh, that that you know that's what the Lord does. He 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 ordains prophets before they before they come into existence you know um uh let me go to uh amos three I'm going to amos three and seven this amos three and seven says surely Yahweh power will do nothing but he revealed his secrets unto the servants the prophets um and the most high he revealed the the true wisdom knowledge understanding to the uh the prophets to the men of the Lord on the highways and byways um because um we we prophesy in part and we know in part we 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 got uh basically the one hundred percent true but we know what we need to know you know um and that's what um we what's been revealed to us you know um uh I'm gonna go to Proverbs eight and four. This is Proverbs 8 
and four, it says, Unto you, O men, I call, and my voice is unto the sons of men. And <clears throat> the men of the Lord, because the Most High only deals with the men when it comes to this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. He doesn't deal with, um, you know, the woman, per se, when it comes to this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, especially um, because the women are not supposed to be teaching. It's um, all up to the men to be, you know, prophesying, teaching, and uh, doing this work for the Lord, you know. The women are supposed to be mostly at home and not out here prophesying and doing what a man is supposed to be doing. Um, basically, I'm I'm done. I'm going to say all praise and honor and glory to Yahweh, Bashim Yahshah, Bashim Kakadash, double honors to the elder, apostle, great millstone, and salutation, I can teach all true sincerity and